All right, hey guys, so Grid 2 is completely free on the Humble Store for the next few days. You'll get a Steam key, which you can activate on your account and own it forever. Again, this is a limited time offer, so make sure you pick it up within the next few days. Grid 2 is a street racing sim or racing game that came out in 2013. It has some interesting mechanics, like a rewind button, so if you hit a wall, you can actually reverse time like 5 or 10 seconds and then start again. So it's a little bit forgiving in that sense if you make a mistake, uh, but overall, it's a pretty good game and the graphics still hold up today so I would highly recommend picking that up alongside that I just wanted to I guess just uh, talk a little bit about the Halo Master Chief collection it is being released on Steam which is very exciting news because this is the first time Halo has been on Steam since Halo 1 I believe a long long time ago I think they released Halo 2 as well but that's so many years ago. They didn't release any of the newer games. Uh, so yeah, it's very exciting. Uh, the first two games are remastered. There's six games in total. They are also releasing Halo Reach, uh, which is a big one alongside ODST and then all the other games as well, except for Halo 5, of course. It is going to be like a tiered launch. So they're first going to release Halo Reach and then they'll release each other game individually. So they're trying to... Um, I guess stagger it out a little bit so that they can make sure each game uh, performs well on PC, which is understandable because when Halo MCC first came out on the Xbox One, it was kind of a disaster. Uh, the single player was great, but the multiplayer just didn't work very well. They tried to do way too much at once and then they sort of rushed it to release and the servers were terrible. So hopefully the PC version will be good and I'm kind of excited to see if there's going to be like modding support because that was a big thing on the original games when they first came out on PC Halo 1 and Halo 2 so uh, yeah really exciting to see Halo MCC come out on Steam if you played a lot of Halo when you were younger you can actually go to Halo Waypoint and see your old stats all the way back to Halo 2 so it has my record from when I was like I guess 11 or 12 years old I played over 10,000 games of Halo 2 online uh, with 55,000 and kills and then moving to Halo 3 I had 12,900 multiplayer games with uh, 109,000 total kills and it shows my multiplayer playtime was about 53 days so I played a shit ton of Halo 3 really really enjoyed that game and I was like the highest rank possible I played all the other games as well just not as much as the original Halo 2 and Halo 3 so that's pretty cool um, all you have to do is sign into your Xbox account on the Halo Waypoint site I'll have a link in the description if you guys are interested in that and uh, I might pick up like a Halo figure if you go to like AliExpress the Chinese website they make all sorts of different figures for like super cheap so I might pick up just like a Master Chief figure while I'm waiting for it to come out on PC because I'm just super excited for it to find be released. So that's it for this video. Not too much going on, but Grid, T Grid 2 is completely free. Uh, I guess I should go ahead and just launch that and play it for a little bit. So Okay, so this is the first race of Grid 2. I really think the graphics still hold up today. Looks really nice. I'm not very good at racing sims, by the way. I like more arcade racing games that are a little bit more forgiving. Uh, this game, if you like hit a wall, it can completely screw you over. But there is a rewind function, which I'll show you in a moment. I right, try to catch up. Get some nice drifting. Final lap, only one more position, and you've got this in the bag. All right, so I definitely hit that wall way too hard and completely screwed up. I can press the button to just rewind time, and then I can try that again. And honestly, I should probably slow down here a little bit. All right, that works. And I pass the first placement. So yeah, this is definitely like an enjoyable game. Usually it's $30 on the Steam store, so uh, getting it for free is pretty nice. Especially for those of you out there that don't have a lot to spare. I think it has uh, Steam trading cards as well. I could be mistaken on that, but I'm pretty sure it does. And we made it. 
Unfortunately, there's not um, like first person cam view or like driver seat view. So it's a third person raider, racer. But uh, overall, I think it's pretty enjoyable. It has quite a bit of content and lots of racing. You can play it online with your friends as well. So all the links will be in the description below. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.